Welcome back to my farm on the crops. So, last um, VTube, if you uh, if you watched, we basically just um, logged into the game and um, I showed you a few things here and there. We planted some crops. And I promised that in a few days we will be harvesting and I will be streaming that. So that is what we are going to do today. We are going to stream. Um, sorry, I mean, we are going to harvest the crops we planted. And there is something super exciting going on right now on the crops. I mean Xmas event. There is tons and tons of prizes to win. To like, it's just amazing. We're going to go through that particular um, um section in a bit after harvesting and whatnot. We will also be planting mystery seeds. We will basically showing you how to buy boosters how to apply boosters and um, planting mystery seeds and yeah see what we get from planting those yeah so let's get right into it and log in we first want to play now and let's go printer logging with my keychain no idea why it's wasting time all right good it's up and voila we are right in the game so we're just going to collapse this we don't need it expanded um so a few days ago i um i re-rolled a few of my quests and i if you can recall this last but this last quest i was unable to re-roll it because there was a few, one or two problems, I don't know, with um, buying or depositing crops, which got fixed that hours later after I reported the issue in, um, <clears throat> in support and help. The developer immediately fixed that particular issue and I was able to reroll. And when I rerolled, I got the quest to harvest five strawberries. I planted one strawberry as you can see it's completed and when I harvested it I harvested four so I need to harvest strawberries again to be able to get five out of five and then this quest will this particular item here will be deemed complete and that is it then I will need to harvest some cauliflowers potatoes and rosemary to complete the other quest and be rewarded with my chest size of 10. Yay, I'm happy. So what we're going to be doing today is uh, we'll just go, we already on play and we'll just expand this again and then right down to farm. Let's see what we have. Yay! We have seven plots ready for harvest. As you can see, if the timer here is showing green and isn't uh, and is and is not uh, vibrating, it means your work your your crops is still maturing. But as we can see here, we have this orange clock stopwatch vibrating vibrating it's to tell you that yeah this particular um crop is ready for harvest so yes we have seven plots ready for harvest and we have two leaves yay my two leaves are ready for harvest sweet all right and um, what do we have yes we have rosemary stew ready for harvest this is great but before we harvest, let us 
go to hmm, let's go to our Xmas event and talk a little about Xmas event because something about this Xmas has to do with me harvesting. Like there's something I would like to show, like connect the connect the two stuff together. <laughs> Good. So we're just going to go to Xmas event and voila. Oh my god. This is so beautiful. Merry Christmas. This event will end in 32 days and 14 hours, 24 minutes and less than 5 seconds. <laughs> So we're just going to scroll down, scroll through, and then see what this Xmas event is all about and why I have to come here first before we harvest. You will get it. You will get everything like once I'm done. So let's just go. So we have our Christmas event here on the crop. Super exciting. The first box here, you will see that it says I am on, I am in the nice list. Santa's nice list. Now, this particular uh, um, giveaway here is, uh, well, we've all been on Santa's naughty list this year. <laughs> so you would have to bribe Santa with 5,000 crop tokens to be added to Santa's nice list. And I exchanged a few of my swap hive and got crop tokens, which I paid to be added to the nice list. Now, what's the advantage of being in this nice list? You get to send gifts to random players and also you get to receive gifts because you are also a random player. Um, Fanta Jira is a random player. Uh, Witsy Zell is a random player, you know, we're all random players and the moment you're on Santa's um, nice list, you can send free gifts and you can also receive free gifts. There is also another advantage to it. If you, when you're on Santa's nice list, you can buy some gifts and send those gifts to random players and by doing so, you earn points, which is added to um, a raffle draw. Like you get added to a raffle draw, which you get to win. Either you get to win um, Christmas, you get to win um, Christmas trees, gingerbread cookies. There's a hundred alpha packs of them ready to be, to be like ready to be given as prize. Two hundred beta packs. Oh my God. I don't know this is so unreal like usually they tell us if something is too it's too what it's too good to be true then it is but seriously speaking like this is too good to be true i would really love to win an xmas tree and a gingerbread cookies i love gingerbread cookies i don't know why we did not make gingerbread cookies this time around for christmas I guess we were just all tired we just made random coconut cookies that's all then there is um alpha packs and beta packs i love packs so yes that's it now this is the particular area why i stopped i paused on harvesting it's because you can earn candy canes from carrying out certain activities on the crops and you can then exchange those candy canes for prizes for stuff on the crops for stuff on this x in this x mass event now you can end candy canes by planting you can end candy canes by harvesting or selling by claiming craft items completing a quest buying packs workshop claims and construction equipment like there's just so many ways to earn candy canes and that's why i posted that so that we will know this particular so that you will see this and understand why it's important and this is the only way for you to earn candy canes which, which you can exchange for all of this now the number of candy canes you earn as you can see presently i have zero candy canes and i have zero golden tickets because i am yet to harvest or sell or do any of this list here to earn the candy canes once i do that it my points will be reflected here and i will show you after like 
once we have let's do all those stuff before the end before this stream ends we'll come back here and see how many candy canes i have now the shops are yet to be open once the shops are open i can exchange my candy cane points for a reward chest which i will need 250 candy canes for fatty plus speed grow mystery seeds or even a present then in that present i can earn if i should open a present there's so many things for me to earn from the present i could earn golden tickets from my presents and with golden tickets from my present here i can exchange it for alpha pack better pack xmas trees gingerbread cookies like this is just awesome it's like um uh, if you were present during the Halloween event, this is 10 times better <laughs> than the Halloween event. Like 10 times better, believe me. Um, yes, so these are the items that you find within the, your present. If once you use 250 candy canes to exchange, you have the you have the chance of also pulling one to you have a 30% chance to get 50 one to 50 crops. You have 20% chance to earn a golden ticket. You have a 25% chance to earn one random NFT from the crops events collections and 25% chance to earn sponsored prizes and this sponsored prizes comes from who if you know who who is world wrestling organization and it's an amazing game that just got on hive we are yet to start playing i believe they are still in the developing stage but there's been a lot of hype to this game then we can win maldives pack is from um, 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 Mutera, like it's Mutera is also a new game that we are so super super excited and looking forward to play. And yeah, like I actually named a multi in Mutera Jade Ball. <laughs> yeah, Jade Ball. There was this stuff about name a multi, and when you win, you get a license. Blah blah blah. Well, I named it Jade Ball, and they selected mine. So yeah, I am going to play this game, Mutera. So you can earn one mile dips pack, and you can earn a HK. I can't believe I'm playing all these games. Oh my God, Esther! Oh no. Okay, so um here in HK, um HK Gentry is um isn't this uh what's this uh oh my God oh my God oh my God oh my God uh it's the Hash Kings hash kings yes hash kings hash kings is also a farming simulation game but on hash kings we plant weed <laughs> yes we legally plant and sell weed on hash kings <laughs> oh such a fun game yeah yeah so yeah so you can win a hk gentry pack and you can win pizza we love pizza we love pizza pizza so you can win um two pizza tokens also you can pull that from your um present so it's just fun like don't we all love to open presents like this is what boxing day is all about opening presents winning presents yes yeah, so xmas event is just it's just top notch like i just love this just love everything i'm seeing right now the whole jingling and the whole snow falling oh my my script kitty is a genius really beautiful okay so let's not get too distracted here let's go back to play by clicking on play good now we're going to collapse this again and we are back to um our dashboard we what we will do now is i would like to show you how to um deposit or withdraw your crop tokens so right here in the middle is where you have that particular info when you click on it a dialog box is displayed and this is it you have here you can see your balance in game and also your balance for hive 
on your hive engine and the next just by the side you have your command area where you can type in what you want and and, and click on whether you want it in or out of the game so right now i have 2725 in-game crop tokens and i have 600 ish um crop tokens in my hive engine now i want to bring in the 600 crop tokens so i'm just going to type 600 there and i will click on deposit then wait for um my hive kitchen to pick up <coughs> excuse me so sometimes this hive keychain is just so naughty doesn't pick up when you need it okay it just did so we're just going to confirm that and it says that my crop token was successfully deposited and um i think we can now refresh the game yep collapse this and we can see I just deposited my crop tokens from my hive engine into the game and you can see that my in-game balance is now 3300 now why do I need this we are going to shop shopping we're going to shop yes so we come here and we click on shop and we wait for our two mushroom cute friends to load well actually we are not buying packs we're buying boosters so we're just going to come here and click on boosters Boom. and voila these are the boosters ladies and gentlemen you have you can buy your fatty plus your mystery seed your speed grow your gas we can buy gas <laughs> fanta you were asking about gas yeah this is where you get your gas not not fat gas <laughs> oh my god all right this is where you get your gas and then here you can buy your um reward chest we discussed all of this well without the gas last um last stream so we're not going to go over all this again we're just going to go straight to buying mystery seed so we're just going to click on mystery seeds here Boom. And it's asking me how many mystery seeds do I want? Mm. Let me try to buy 15 mystery seeds. 15 mystery seeds is going to cost me 600 crop. There is a reason why I want this mystery seed. Well, I'm not sure if I want up to this particular amount, but whatever. Let's just buy it. You can never get it wrong with mystery seeds and they're always there when you need it. So yes, so we click on yep. And now we wait for it to verify our purchase. Um, hmm. You know, I would wish for Script Kitty to make this verifying stuff a little bit more entertaining. You know, let's see some animations. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So, we've successfully bought 15 mystery seats. Yo, close. Now we are just 10 days into we have just um sorry we have um 10 days left for this season to end for spring to end so i wouldn't want my mystery seeds to give me to to mysteriously bud into a crop like um, cauliflower that takes about 10 days or 12 days yes 12 days to mature you see that will be outside the 10 days and it will basically be a loss so what i will do is to buy speed grow speed grow will help me lessen the days from 10 to 50 percent which i am banking on at least 15 percent that should leave me around maybe nine eight days or even seven days yes seven days which means that i'll be able to harvest those crops before end of season so we're just going to click on buy speed grow speed, speed grow is just um 30 and um, crops so we're going to buy let's say how many stuff did we buy then let's just buy 15 speed grow for 450 crops you can never get it wrong with speed grow all right damn 
this good so um and now we just wait very fine results there should be some animations good so successfully bought 15 speed glow yay and we're just going to close that now you might say why am i not buying fatty plus fatty plus doubles my chance to get a three star and two star crops oh i don't know do i really need fatty plus well i guess it's not there's no harm in buying just five of it five of it is about 120 what about 10 of it 250 yeah no harm it means that i wouldn't need to buy fatty plus anytime soon moreover i can always exchange my fatty plus uh i can always exchange my candy canes for fatty plus i can always earn more fatty plus from my from completing my daily quest and um, sorry my uh, seasons quest so yeah so many ways to to buy it and that's done we're just going to go back to play and yep we're back to our dashboard now we're going to go to farm so expand it let's go to our farmland and i think we are ready to harvest yay so let's harvest the seven plots now just going to click on harvest wait for the keychain prompt and confirm that yes you want to harvest and let's see oh my let's get some three star two star that would be nice three star two star fingers crossed three star two star three star two star fingers crossed fingers crossed fingers crossed all right well this sometimes takes a long time i don't know why I think it maybe has to do with my network i'm not so sure but yep we have to wait a little bit longer oh beautiful oh, just look at the colors i just love to live just look at the colors so beautiful oh okay oh my god no why all oh, one star no me okay great i have a uh, two star french beans here yeah more reasons to fart yeah <laughs> yeah so we have a two star french beans here and 14 shares from those two star as you can see one share is just seven and 14 shares for two star that's fine well we'll take it i will take this so thank you so much we come down here and we close and reload <clears throat> Now, this activity has just earned me certain candy canes. And we're going to find out how many candy canes I got. Let's just quickly plant. Now, before replanting, as I told you, look at here. Top right. Top right, you will see in a box spring. Changes in 10 days. There are plants, there are crops like cauliflower that takes 10 days to mature. You do not want to gamble with this. You do not want to take your chances. So apply speed grow to avoid storage that touch. Now we're just going to apply our boosters. Apply here. Now I'm not sure which plant or which land exactly will board what. So I'm just going to apply speed grow in all the empty lands so far. So we're going to click here and apply. We have an empty plot here. Uh, close no. We have an empty plot here and have an empty plot average yes apply as you can see the numbers are changing okay we have another empty plot down here another empty plot down here all right so let's take note of where our empty plots are we have one last four so the third row from the bottom middle to great we will not forget that then after our uh, fertile land just below it we have three the first three average lands 
empty plots. We have two empty plots on this factor. We have one empty plot on this awesome land and one empty plot on this high-tech land. We have taken note of all of this. Okay, so we're just going to apply and submit. Oh, this keychain. Great, confirm it. Okay. And we're just going to have to wait again. Verifying result. Pop, pop. We are very good. So we have applied, if you want to see it, we have applied our speed grow to our plots. Now, should we also go ahead to apply fatty plus? I guess we should. So we're just going to apply fatty plus. But I do not want to apply it. Should I? Okay, fine. Let's do it. So I'm going to apply my fatty plus here and all the empty lines again. Apply. 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 Okay. Now we are done and just going to click on submit. Wait on the keychain. Confirm. Okay. Now we wait for this to get confirmed sweet. Now we have successfully applied. Let's click on the slider here, show boosters. We have successfully applied our fatty plus and speed grow, as you can see. FP1 SG1. It means it successfully got applied. Oh, we are just going to go ahead and plant our mystery seeds and see what we got. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Great. So just going to start with the high tech land. Click and click on plants. Click on awesome land. Plant. Click on here. Plant. Click on here. Plant. Come down. Click here. Plant. And plant. And plant. We plant and plant and plant. And then we click on plant selected we have planted 17 out of 50 nfts so we're just going to click on plant selected wait on the keep chain prompt okay and let's see what we got from these mystery seeds that cost us just 40 crop tokens which is presently less than one hive but yes i think although Crop tokens shut off the roof like the price just hiked because of the whole Xmas event bribing Santa stuff. Oh, so if you can recall, these two box here were empty where we just planted. So we have our mystery seeds turned into broccoli, which will be ready for harvest in three days instead of five weeks. And then we have it turns turned into rosemary which will be harvested in a day sweet let's go up the first oh my god everything turned into rosemary and broccoli why i do not even like broccoli <laughs> all right so we have one day for this we have broccoli it turned into broccoli it turned into and uh, rosemary why me why oh my god oh my god people this is so good yes yes a mystery seed turned into a jack o lantern kill me kill me <laughs> and this oh my god i'm so excited i'm sorry i'm just so excited yes 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 Oh my goodness, this is sweet. Good, fine, I'm calm, I'm calm, I'm calm, I'm so damn calm right now. Alright, so we have time required for Jack O'Lantern. What am I reading? Time required, six days, and we have just one. That is not the main thing. The base selling price of Jack O'Lantern is 25 shares, and it produces three meaning 75 shares per harvest and the special ability oh my goodness well this particular crop keeps producing the whole year hey 
in Africa, in Nigeria, we say we don't hammer. Ah, I don't hammer. I don't hammer. Yeah, so Ford, so it's going to produce in spring, it's going to produce in summer, it's going to produce in fall, it's going to produce in winter for crying for G. Oh my, oh my God, Jesus. Like, I can't even afford this particular crop. <sighs> this is going to make me cry. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. This is one of the best Xmas gifts I've gotten online. Beautiful. Yeah, so that's... Oh my God. All right, so here we have a deal, a deal. Beautiful. Thank you so much, dear. Now this is the main thing. A jack-o'-lantern. I got it. A jack-o'-lantern. Okay, now we are done. Oh my God. I think right now, even if I close this stream, it is an achievement, ladies and gentlemen. Like I have achieved in life. <laughs> oh, don't mind me. I just have been so dramatic. Oh, no. Beautiful. Well, as we can see, now we have planted these and we have harvested and we have planted. So I must have earned a few. Um, I must have earned a few uh candy canes which we're going to check how many candy canes i earned yeah all right so we are going to also buy a pack and open it you know to celebrate the jack-o-lantern <laughs> okay so we just go here to decrops.com slash pack it's just right here in shop because we are shopping and you scroll down, we still have about 259,162 packs left on the market available to be bought. And I think we are going to be the ones to remove the two right here. So that means there will just be 259. 160 packs left by the time I am done buying. And for this Xmas um, event, we have been given a 15% discount. This is just beautiful. This 50% discount will only hold as long as this event holds, and that should be in that should be only for the next 32 days ish. After that, the price goes back to three dollars. As opposed to instead of two point five five dollars per pack, so we're just going to go here and then type two. <clears throat> oh my God, seventeen! So I don't want to use my hive to buy it, so I'm just going to use my swipe. Oh, let me see whether I had. Oh, I just need five thousand one hundred crops to buy. Let me see if I can use one. Let me see, 2,500, This is basically saying one, um, $1 is to what? What am I saying? Okay, no, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm terribly mad, so forgive me for that. We're just going to pretend I did not say that. But I think I can buy using crop tokens, but I don't have up to that. So we're just going to skip all that terrible math, math I just did. so we're going to buy two packs and it cost 5.1 dollars instead of the six well that's sweet so it's going to cost us 17.29 swipe hive to get two packs and I'm just going to click on submit oh we should get the key prompts right about now if it doesn't I'll need to activate it myself no idea why it's the delay. Hmm, let's see. Hmm, is there a reason for the delay? Why isn't my keychain picking up? Oof. Wow. Seriously, this is so beautiful. Look at how the snow, you know, the snowflakes. Great, so my kitchen picked up. 
Oh, we're just going to wait for it to say confirm buying two packs. Yes. And yes, and we're just going to wait for our two mushroom friends to verify our purchase. Pam 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 Oh successfully added two better packs to your account, closing this page in zero. Load and balance these and packs. You see, we just bought the two packs right here. <laughs> now that we have bought two packs, we're just going to go back to open. And we click on open. Yes, here we have our two packs right here. And we can open them. So let's open and see what we got. Is there anyone online for a giveaway? Hmm, I don't think anyone is online, so yeah, too bad. So we're just going to click on balances and we can open a pack at a time if we want to. Should we? Should we? Okay, maybe we should open a pack at a time. Yeah. So we're just going to click on submit here. I think there should be a keychain prompt again. Yep, there is a keychain prompt again. There is a keychain prompt for every single thing. I love it. Okay, so opening packs and just going to wait for our cute farmer friend. Yay, thank you. Okay, so we have three and we're just going to go with, oops. Uh oh, ah, it seems like I have an epic card here, the purple underneath. The rest are commons, but uh, let's see, open it. Oh, a basil. Thank you. <gasps> Plain rice. I'm not a fan of rice, but yay. Oh, a classic sandwich. Oh, this is so beautiful. And onions, the whole green in between the bread. Oof, I'm getting hungry. All right, good. Not a good time to eat. It's 12 midnight, so go back. And we have one more pack to open. Okay, I think we might need to refresh because it's great. So we have one more pack to open. Pim, pim, pim. And we're just going to submit that. Open it. All right, all right. Our little cute farmer friend. Okay. So we come here. Oh, we have an epic here. We have another common. We have another common. So let's open the epic. I got a house. An epic house. Yes. Oh, today is just my lucky day. I got an NPC house. An epic house. Good. So let's see what we have here. Oh, parsley. I love parsley. Seriously, I do. I love them when I chop them up. Time. Nice. Beautiful. I think. Wow, this is a success, really. Mm, nice. So we're just going to go back here and back to playing. Collapse this. And as we can see, I have just three more quests to fulfill or to complete and I can earn my reward chest. Then we can open and see what is it I got from it. What do I inside this beautiful treasure uh -huh. now this is done let's go back to why does it say i have one better pack i think i need to refresh this except if i got a pack by miracle oh no no miracle here sorry 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 no miracle <laughs> okay so we go back to xmas event and let's see what my whole up and down got me 579 candy sticks beautiful i can exchange it for presents for 250 candies and even another reward chest for 250 this yeah definitely exchange it for this kind for this present and a reward chest oh my god i can even exchange it for two presents and get and have extra 79 on top and exchange them for more candy canes here 
This is beautiful. Oh, this is nice. I love it. I love it. Okay, so we're just going to go back here to all right so that is it for now once shop is declared open for us to exchange i will come on stream again and we can exchange and open our presents together hopefully we will have more people have anyone is there anyone out there like this is titanic show right now I'm flashing my torch can anyone hear me there's no one online. Hopefully, there will be a few people online. And when we open the presents, going to buy more packs then. And we can open and do a giveaway. There will also be a sponsored giveaway by the crops. That will be announced on my Twitter. So, if you are not following me on Twitter, check me out on at Queenstar14. Queenstar14. That is my Twitter handle. And just give me a follow. Turn on the notification bell there too. So that when I announce the giveaway, you will, be, you will know and follow whatever rules will be attached to that giveaway. And yeah, we will pull that event and giveaway packs, prizes, whatever it is the crops gives me to give out to my friends, my followers. So that's it. That's it about the crops for today i hope i am not missing anything did i say i was going to do something last that i didn't oh yes let us come here just a sneak peek we're going to expand it and we're going to go to crafting crafting there is a, there's something i want us to see here sweet so in our crafting there is so much we can do here you can craft recipes now you can craft sugar from your harvested beetroot oh this is beautiful i love everything happening right now so you can use two beetroots you can use whatever you can use either one star beetroot two star beetroot three star beetroot it depends on what you have i do not have okay i have um i just have a one star beetroot but i have six six two star beetroots and i have 17 one star beetroots so you can select here under your settings um how many beetroots you want you, or what quality i think quality or rarity i don't know yeah here and you can exchange it you can craft sugar from it so once you do this you get your sugar the only thing missing right now is I will need to buy gas and also get a windmill and also, okay, I think that's it. Because for me to get a windmill, I will also need to construct, go to the workshop to construct a windmill, which I will need a plot. If that is, okay, to be honest, that is a whole lot. This is something there's going to be a separate stream for that so that we don't get things all mixed up but um yeah i'm super excited about this particular aspect this particular activity here um so many so down from crafting cooking um uh, workshops yeah this is where you craft your items um what else um construction so this is also where you can craft your windmill. You need to select your plots that you can craft it, but you need a blueprint for a way for, for windmill. We're not going to bore ourselves with that at the moment. Then you have your orchard here. If you have any trees, um, you can claim your fruits here. This is just so beautiful. So yeah, so that is it for now. Again, we are celebrating our mystery sea turning into Jack Olanta. Yeah. Come over, let's go see how much a jack o' lantern costs. That is if it's on the market. So we go and click market and um hmm, great. So we can scroll and try to find a jack o' lantern. Is there anyone selling a jack o' lantern? I doubt it. It's so precious. I don't know who would want to sell that. Well, let's just see if anyone oh 
Okay, yes, you can't sell a jack o' lantern, I think, or is it that no one is selling it? I don't know because it's so rare. It's so rare to have to get to get a jack o' lantern to get a jack o' lantern was from a mystery seed turning into a legendary jack o' lantern. It's unheard of. Like I just scored that, like whoop, scored that stuff. Oh, so that is it for this stream. I hope you enjoyed following me through and celebrating with me. And uh, well, nobody's online to ask questions right now. But as I said, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me a message on Discord or even under any post of mine on hive.blog slash at queenstar or on any under any tweet of mine on twitter and i will answer you the moment i receive it or when once i have the chance to or the answers for those questions i will do that um so this is wishing you um a merry happy holiday season and um a prosperous new year 2023 is going to be awesome uh, see you there see you I think um, wait from nine days from now oh definitely new season new year beautiful so see you then bye